I've owned two cars in my life. I had to donate blood to keep gas in both of them. That's why I study financial literacy. I'm Tyel McNeary, and I'm what they call an expert on life. We walking down the street, right? I don't know you, you don't know me. We happen to make eye contact. This is the face I'm making. I probably make the same face you make forever. All right, let me see it, let me see it. <laughs> so that's my rest and kick ass face. You understand the rest and kick ass face? This is my turn. Like a skunk. <laughs> Do I look approachable? No. Nope. See? That's the point. That's the point. You walk around looking all happy and stuff. Somebody gonna run up on you, eh? I thought I thought you were supposed to be happy. <laughs> <laughs> we happen to make eye contact, and this is the face I'm making. What does that face say to you? You probably most likely had a horrible day. You probably don't want my company or attention, so <laughs> I'm most likely gonna keep it pushing. In certain areas, you might have to put that face on necessarily to protect yourself in some cases. For sure. But at the end of the day, that's what we getting at, though. You know what I'm saying? It's a deterrent. That's my don't mess with me face. Mm -hmm. You got a face like that? Yeah, you got a look that you put on when you don't want to be bothered. Let me see it. Probably make a face like... White people. I'm just about to speak to y'all as a delegate. <laughs> as a liaison for the black community real quick. We are not scary. We are not always mad. Contrary to what white people may believe. We have this resting, sitting, kick ass face. That's what it's called. <laughs> They're sitting, kick ass face. And it's for black people. And it's not, it's not a face that shows your natural emotion. It's not that. It's just the face. It's like a shield. Because as a black person, you go through this world, and any, at any time, somebody might pull your card. <laughs> However, you got to know. <laughs> That you need to avoid those situations at all costs because the consequences for those situations aren't the same for you. So what you do is you walk around with this natural deterrent on. <laughs> it happens in that in nature, people. Like the skunk spray you and it stinks, so you leave the skunk alone. The rest and kick ass face. This just say, don't get your ass kicked today. <laughs> That's all it is. And we just happen to catch eye contact. This is my face. What does that face say to you? says you really don't know me, I don't know you, and I have no problems with you. You kind of got arrested kick ass face all right now. <laughs> I grew up in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. What does that face mean to you? I mean, it could mean anything. I feel like that's what my face looks like most of the time I'm walking <laughs> down the street. You could have the uh, resting bee face going on. I lived about two blocks away from the house where Jeffrey Dahmer lived and did all of his horrible crimes. There's a lot of socioeconomic problems in that area. And you put on that face as a sign of, I don't want to be bothered, and I won't bother you. Can we I'm just do our face for the camera real quick, together? <laughs> <laughs> That's all it is. Once you walk up and the ice is broken and we realize that you don't, you're not doing anything where you may need to get your ass kicked, everything is okay. Everything is fine. You see that face just... F just turn right into a smile. You see it go away just like that, but... Uh, on the offset, you just got to understand. Be realistic with yourself and the conditions that we go through in society. Understand that we got to have the rest of kick ass face. I'm a pretty upbeat character, so you know what I'm saying? I try to keep a smile on my face, you know what I'm saying, to brighten the next person's day. This can be deceiving. You can, you can see somebody walking down the street with the nicest face ever. And they be tripping. They be tripping. <laughs> That's a nice way to get around a conversation you don't want to be See, in. This is where I start telling people, you can forget your headphones, but you can't forget your face. I may be wrong, <laughs> but I doubt it. <laughs>